All right, so this is a review on an album. I'm gonna call it an album or a project. Um, it's called by what I say. I may be pronouncing that wrong, or what I say. Bit and um, Senku Live. Um, that project's called Wala or Wala, which is the man and the god. The artwork is um, something that I would expect of. I say expect of, but I, I've, I only found out about this artist, or what I say, through Sway. Um, um, Sway, not Sway Cataway, but Sway Decipher. Um, which is interesting because I saw it on his Instagram the other day. I was like, right, I've got to find out more about this artist. And lo and behold, I'm here reviewing his, his um, project with Zenko Live. Uh, but yeah, the artwork is basically, it's very like, what's the word? Like you can tell the authenticity of it. Like you can tell where they come from, like the continent they come from, which is good. Yeah. I don't want to explain it other than that. Um, so there is 10 tracks. So there's Chant, then there's Wozo, then there's Foku, then there's Animate, then there's Verku, then there's Aquasia, then there's Four Years, then there's Odozo, then Preak, then We All Got, We All G O Die. Um, yeah, so what I liked about this project or album is the fact that it, it's like, the vibes, like, not I look at this way, yeah. Afrobeats obviously is a wave, it's a thing, and all that stuff there. But the vibe on this thing here is what I really would consider. I mean, it's, Afrobeats is still an African type of music anyway, but it's like, I don't know, the, the vibe, it's like it feels more. I don't know, it feels more homely, if that makes sense. Like, I'm not particularly too sure where this brother is from, actually. I think he's Ghanaian, which would make sense because Sway's Ghanaian, but um, it's just the fact of... I don't know, it, it just feels like it's the type of music I need to be listening to on a regular basis. That's just me, yeah? And I would recommend that you listen to it and then you can feel whether you should be listening to it on a regular basis. So, um, although this was released back in 2019, didn't it? So, and yeah, I, I, if he has more in his lock in regards to this, I'm looking forward to more of the stuff that he's going to be producing. And if he's working with Sway, then I can only assume that it's only going to be great things even more because... Sway is a phenomenal artist himself, even though I know him as doing like UK rap, but it's just, I don't know what capacity he's working with him. I, I don't know whether it's on the manager, management side or I don't know, do you see what I mean? But whatever the case is, I'm looking forward to it and all that stuff there. Now, as usual, I take one song, if it's in um, context or out of context, it is what it is. Um, and that is uh, Chant Because when it comes down to life Or anything in general Your words have power Right Your words have power So when you're chanting It's like affirmations Do you see what I mean Like affirmations are like chanting Because you're repeating the words You're saying over and over and over again Now you don't necessarily say it over and over and over and over and over and over again But it is powerful. Think about it. If you say, um, let me think of an affirmation. Um, I am blessed. I'm going to be receiving miracles. I am blessed. I'm going to be receiving miracles. In fact, let me say it this way. I am blessed and I'm going to be receiving miracles in abundance. I am blessed. I'm going to be receiving miracles in abundance. I am blessed. I'm going to be receiving miracles in abundance. Like, keep on saying it. Keep on saying it. I am blessed, I'm going to be receiving miracles in abundance. I am blessed, I'm going to keep receiving uh, miracles in abundance. Think about it, you're, like, think, you're, you're saying it, you're feeling it even more. And what's even more interesting is, they're saying it in their own 
language. So if you're saying it in your own ancestral tongue, just think about even more powerful that is. How much you're going to manifest your desires and stuff like that. But hold up. If you click the link in the description box below, it says become a member of the Akibuna Trust, you will get access to online courses such as African and Caribbean history. And that's where you're going to learn more to do with, you know, finding out your true ancestral roots and all that stuff there. And learn more to do with African and Caribbean history. Yeah. But back to the album or the project, I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Um, simply because of the vibe that it, that it brings that I get out of it. I don't know, there's something powerful about it that I genuinely fucking love. Yeah, I just love it. Yeah. Um, and like I said, I don't know if he's gone or not. Like, and this is the beautiful thing, beautiful thing about music. Yeah. It doesn't matter where they are from. If you feel music and you feel the artist and you feel the vibe, you feel it, you're going to connect with it and you're going to do what's necessary. Do you see what I'm saying? But the link to the album is in the description box below. Go stream it, go stream that, go stream that. And yeah, if you've got any questions, any topics you'd like for us to discuss in our videos, go ahead, leave that in the comment section below. And big up Sway for um, um, his post on this guy, what I say. Um, because if it wasn't for that, I probably would have not, never known who this person was. Or probably I would have because of the stuff that I do with the Akibu and Trust. But other than that, Sway, give me big up each and every day. So if you've got any questions, any topics you'd like for us to discuss in the videos, leave that in the comment section below. And remember, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification because you never know the video you suggest might just be next.